Hey guys, what's up? This is your boy Wolf for Action Figure Review and I'm really excited today. Today we're going to talk about the Game of Death Bruce Lee by Interbay. Um, not, not much about the entire kit, but we're going to talk about the heads. The Battle Damage head and the Smiley head, which I bought. Um, and I also bought the, the Game of Death suit. Um, let's get down to the suit. The suit is immaculate, all right, guys. There is no doubt this is a really good game of death suit. Um, the weathering was done well, like he, he, he looks like he was in a battle. Um, I love the way they did this suit, it fits like a glove, it's not overly baggy and it's not too tight, it's just right on the money. It fits so well on the 3.5 interbay body, as you can see here. Um, now let's get down to the real deal here, okay? The battle damage Bruce Lee had that everybody's complaining about, and I have my complaints also, but look at that. I look like I'm staring into a fish. What's up with that, Interbay? Why would you take this head and change it from the prototype? And I think I have a few answers for that. Um, if this is one of the solutions and it's the, you have to move the eyes that's it you have to position the eyes to pose them in the way you want okay the hair comes right off as you can see here um this is definitely the best um position for the eyes uh it's a shame that um uh, interbay did not keep the prototype head i felt that they should have it was the best head sculpt they ever created Definitely better than the Hot Toys one. This is the Game of Death Battle Damage Head on a Hot Toys body. Um, I'm going to tell you guys right now, do not try to force the head on the Hot Toys body, being that the ball joint underneath, um, underneath the Game of Death Bruce Lee head is slightly bigger. You will damage your Hot Toys body if you try to force it in. This is a side-by-side -side comparison of the Hot Toys Bruce Lee with the Interbay Bruce Lee. Um, as you can see, there is a big size difference, so I'm assuming that the body, the newer Interbay body, will, will compensate the size difference of this head. Um, once again, uh, a side-by-side -side comparison of the smiley face with the battle damage face. As you can see, the smiley face looks a little bit bigger over the regular battle damage face, I, I think because of the smile, you know, the smile. Oh yeah. Anyway, this is a great position for the smiley face Bruce Lee uh, head um, slightly over the shoulder um, looking at his opponent. I, I think this is a really good um, pos posture for him. If you want to position him when you get the new body, this is a really good pose for him. Uh, this by far is the best position for the battle damage head. An exhausted looking Bruce Lee looking at his next opponent but with some seriousness. Woody agrees and I agree. Do I think it's worth $300? Uh, eh, you know what, for $300 it's worth it because you get all the accessories, you get the clothing, you get the Bruce Lee's. It should come with an extra body. That's something I agree with um, Barry Elms about. It should, it, for $300 definitely should have came with another body. I'm a banana, I'm a banana.